Hey everybody, welcome to the Krog and Cordy Show's Cash Vaults. We're here with another installment where we ask each other questions and ask the viewer questions. I'm here with Krog. Hey. And Yo. I am, of course, Cordy. So here we go. Uh, did you want to ask your question first, Krog? Or? Yep. Yeah, I will ask away. All right, what we got? What? What is your top three free-to-play Steam games? All right. I thought I thought it would be hard, but then I remembered a lot of games aren't on Steam or they're not free to play. <laughs> so and it was like like stuff like CS:GO. I'm like, wait, that's not free. I mean, okay. If so, you yeah. don't know what Steam is, it's a platform on the computer yeah. that you can play stuff, play games, download games. The best. It's basically, a launcher, kind of. CS:GO. Yeah. All right. So th my third pick was Dota 2 like League of Legends if you don't know what Dota 2 is you don't know what either it's are a it's a MOBA you basically have two sides they fight each other um, Dota I, tr I try to pick games that have a lot of bang for their buck which is zero dollars but it just like you can get tons of hours of gameplay <laughs> out of these games for nothing so that's huge bang for your buck all right so yeah, two is a one that I stumbled across and I want to go back to but it's a uh, Conqueror's Blade it's kind of like you have an army and they kind of follow you around you can command them but you just have like one small army that goes with you and you'll have like 5v5 or 8v8 so it looks like a big battle but it's, you know you only control a portion of it but it's really cool there's a lot to do a lot to upgrade a lot of different weapons you can upgrade and stuff so good one bang for your buck and then this one I just had to because uh, I'm playing a lot of this lately Warframe my number one because uh, if you played Destiny 2 or were thinking of getting Destiny 2, I wouldn't spend the money till you try Warframe. Because it seems like Warframe is the game that Destiny 2 should have been. So, yeah, and, and there's just, there's so much more depth in it. And I mean, I've already gotten in like 30 hours of gameplay and I'm just like, not, I'm like, not nowhere. I still, you can yeah. fish, you can, you can mine, you can upgrade your mods, you can upgrade your weapons, upgrade your... There's like different warframes you have, which is basically your abilities. Crazy. Crazy, crazy good. Very in depth. Yes. Yes. Alright, so moving along. Beautiful. It is. Game. It is very immersive. It's cool to watch. Cool. I would right. I would suggest playing on like a PlayStation or an Xbox because it's probably pretty demanding on a PC. Unless you have a really good PC. Now I'm moving yeah. on. Alright, so I got a question here for Krog. I'm very interested to see how he answers this. All right. What are the top three times you fought going to the bathroom while playing a game? <laughs> All right. We're going to go from most recent to happened long ago. I would okay. start long ago first, right? Or whatever. Long ago first? Yeah. I want to hear the most recent that I laugh at you up here. All right. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. So long ago, the th number three here. Um, NES after bedtime. You wouldn't want to go to the bathroom because you'd wake up mom and then <laughs> right. end your NES after dark spree. Yeah, your session would be over immediately. Over, yeah. So you would hold it. <laughs> Just jam out games after bedtime. Right, right. Uh, it was great. I'm sure a lot of gamers have done that. Oh, I'm sure. I mean, even till you're like, you know, of age where your parents aren't, you're not living with your parents, basically, because <laughs> you don't want to disturb them. But all right, what else we got? All right. Game Battles Wars. If you've ever heard of Game Battles, it's uh, now yep. uh, Major League Gaming. So you've heard of it now if you're a game, but it's um, not only yeah, Game Battles Wars lasted like at the very least an hour in SOCOM and Call of Duty when we used to play them. Yeah, I mean, even recently doing um, like the new Call of Duty Modern Warfare, we did some game battling. And just like even the time it takes to get everyone together on the same page, get a match found and everything, it's like there's always someone yeah, running off to the bathroom, bathroom in the middle. Really? The bathroom. Bathroom. The bathroom. <laughs> All right, you got another one for us? Or was that as it? well? Uh, and my th last one, number one, is Rocket League. It's so, it's so stupid because they're only like 
10 minute rounds maybe less than that even because it's like five minutes but then there's small pauses so right. at maximum like 10 minute rounds most of the time and it's just you'll just keep looping habit. rounds yeah yeah you get in the next time you like hit x twice yeah. and force of habit you do it don't realize you do it <laughs> get up to go to the bathroom and you hear beep no, no. It's like halfway through the match, you're doing the pee dance, and by the time you get to the end, you're like, "Okay, we can do another." Crap! I needed a piss. Damn it! <laughs> exactly. I, I wanted to hear this some stories. So quick, Did you actually? Fun. I mean, is there anything? Any fluids came out at any point in these? I wanted to hear some story like you pooped yourself or something. I don't know. Probably when I was a kid. Uh, now you're able to hold <laughs> no. it. I've had like. I don't think I've ever. I've had pooped myself. I'm pretty good. Yeah, not playing games, but. You know, when I was a, a kid and you were like stuck in a car or something, but um, that's another story. But I remember though one time we were playing on our dad's computer. We were like eight years old or something like that. We had our buddy over and like I was trying to beat this board on that like Syria game or whatever it is. I forget what it's called. Siberia. Siberia. Right. Yeah. And I just was like I had to pee, had to pee, and then it just it just went <laughs> like. Just, is myself there playing the game uh it's pretty bad pretty bad all right so with that lovely note uh we got the question of the day here for everybody so what is your favorite gaming console so if you haven't subscribed already please hit the subscribe button and uh we'll be back here again tomorrow doing the same thing and uh down in the comments below anything that you like dislike and your answer to this question what is your favorite gaming console? What you got, Kroggle? Oh, I was going to ask you first. Oh, you're going to ask me? Okay, mine is PC. Kind of a cop-out, but... PC. Kind of. I mean, I've played... Course, I've so. definitely played more games on PC just because it's a much more open platform. And I've always, like, you know, liked building computers and making them run the max on games. So, that's just... I mean, other than that, I would say, like, PS4, like, whatever's newest. Because, I mean, I like the retro stuff, but I'm not, like, I'm, like, living in the past. I like the new, want to see what else is coming out. Yeah, that's, that's why I was going to say PlayStation 5. That's, that's my yeah, that's right that's now. what I would have said, too. <laughs> yeah, PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5. Makes sense. Uh, I'm looking forward to that. There's actually right. a couple of whispers. It's being dropped soon, so... Yeah, we'll see. PS5, baby, let's go. All right, guys. Yep, let us know what your favorite console is. And uh, say goodbye to Krog. Bye. Bye. I'm Cordy, and we'll catch Peace. you guys next time. Peace.